Welcome to 60 Second Civics, the daily podcast of the Center for Civic Education. I'm Mark Gage. Unlike the American Constitution, the British Constitution is not entirely written down. Instead, the British Constitution is composed of common law, acts of parliament, court decisions, and long-established practices and traditions. Three documents play a very important role in the British Constitution. These are the Magna Carta of 1215, the Petition of Right of 1628, and the English Bill of Rights of 1689. The Magna Carta established that there were limits to the king's power and spelled out some of the basic rights of Englishmen. The Magna Carta reinforced the idea that Britain was a country governed by the rule of law. The Petition of Right of 1628 referred to the Magna Carta as the basis for its legitimacy. Like so many conflicts between the king and parliament, the Petition of Right came about because the king tried to pressure his subjects for money without the consent of parliament. This led to parliament forcing King Charles I to agree to the Petition of Right, which stated, among other things, that the king could raise taxes only with the consent of Parliament. Finally, the Bill of Rights of 1689 established parliamentary privilege, which meant that Parliament would meet frequently, would have free elections of members of the House of Commons, and would have freedom of speech within Parliament. Other protections included the guarantee against cruel and unusual punishment, and the right to fair treatment by the courts. These protections influenced the American Bill of Rights, which was ratified a little more than 100 years later, in 1791. That's all for today's podcast, 60 Second Civics, where civic education only takes a minute.